people. It's your boy, the host with the most. I do not brag on both. I'm coming to you live from coast to coast. It's your boy, Chris the Don One. Please be sure to hit that notification bell, hit that subscription button, okay? Rate, comment, subscribe, like the video. Also, comment in the comment section. Tell me if you like these reactions. The latest edition of Cheetah Got Exposed, okay? Which, by the way, Let's roll that video being footage. Okay, guys, I do apologize. I cannot upload this video with the sound because there's a lot of copyright music um, in this video that I didn't notice after me editing this video. I noticed that it had several copyright issues. So you know how YouTube, YouTube be tripping. Okay, but basically, I'm gonna give you a quick rundown. She called him red handed, and he's claiming that this girl is his home girl, a friend, a friend around the way. And as you're looking, she basically told him to take off the tennis shoes and the socks because she bought them. All right, so we're gonna address this video later on. Okay, I do apologize. Sorry. Okay, after watching this video, so many questions, not enough time in the day, okay? First of all, let's just break this video down, shall we? All right, sir, if you're gonna cheat on your significant other, why take the person, the cheaty, to a public atmosphere? Why Walmart, okay? What, what did Walmart do to you, man? What did Walmart do to you, sir, okay? Walmart used to be a fun, family-friendly place, okay? Where you can shop with your family, you can take your kids along with you, you can get a multitude of things at Walmart, okay? You can get the latest fashion, you can also get some furniture, you know, uh, get some stuff to clean around the house, get food products, okay? Uh, not to mention, if you're into that, you can get some fitness. And by the way, you can get some new tires for your car, plus an oil change. It's an all-in-one stop for life, okay? An all-in-one stop for life, okay? Instead of going to XYZ, ABC, just make your way to Walmart, please, okay? Why in God's green herb you're going to use the self-checkout area okay now i know a lot of people are going to say what does the self-checkout area has anything to do with this video allow your boy to explain at least if you was at a regular checkout stand and your significant other catches you with your um you know your side piece at least you can tell your your significant other oh look i don't know this girl all right have no clue who this girl is all right what you've been following me this whole time this whole time you've been following me okay well i'd be damn honey Th this lady has been following me as well i am so glad honey you've been following me all this time i was getting kind of paranoid my negro senses were tingling i was wondering why this other lady was walking alongside me okay Stranger alert, stranger danger alert. I am so glad that you're here, honey. She got loud with it, okay? Is this what you do? Is this what you do? You cheat on me? Man, the embarrassment that this guy was going through, all right? Now, even though, you look, we can't co-sign for us as men to cheat on our significant other. That's one thing we're not gonna do here. We're not even gonna do it anywhere, okay? There's not a man on this planet is going to sympathize and co-sign to what you did, okay? What's wrong is wrong. What's right is right. What's wrong is wrong. And I'm telling you, my good friend, okay? When you cheat on your significant other, that is totally wrong. But like I always say in these reaction videos, okay? If you're gonna cheat, okay cheat in the right way okay even though it's wrong if loving you is wrong i don't want to be right okay but if you're going to cheat at least cheat 
properly, all right? Another thing I noticed in this video is, man, she was dressing him down, okay? Literally and figuratively, okay? She told him, those are my shoes, okay? I bought you them shoes. Take off them shoes. That dude hurried up immediately, take off them Air Force One, all right? Then she said, I also bought you them socks. God damn. You mean to tell me she's going to buy you $100, $200 uh, shoes and you can't even afford socks? Come on, my good friend, all right? Not only had to take the shoes off, he had to take the socks off, okay? Uh, someone said in the conversation was funny. You knew that guy was going to cheat on you because you bought him shoes. That's why he walked That's why he walked off on you. He walked away from you. Then he's trying to explain it, okay? Making up all types of excuses. This is my home girl, okay? What's the difference between a home girl and your side piece, okay? Because let me tell you something. A lot of guys are not going to admit this, but I'm going to admit this to you ladies, okay? Live and direct in 4K, 8K, every day, all day. Even the average girl know this to be true, all right? Any guy that says that she is my friend, that's a girl that at first he wanted to bone that girl, okay? Every woman, any average woman, any woman with an IQ of two dead fry, flies should figure that out. You wanted to bone her in the worst way. This video, I wasn't 100% sure if this video was authentic, okay? Ooh, that's a lovely word, authentic. Was this video was a hoax? Was this video, was they, were they making this video on the purpose of going viral, okay? Now, people in the comment section believe that this video is authentic. That's another great word, authentic. And a lot of people think that this is a fake video that they just wanted to blow up and go viral, you know, sort of 50-50. I'm just gonna co-sign to the fact that, you know, maybe this video is accurate. Okay, maybe this video is true. How are you gonna take your home girl or the girl that you want to bone at home? Why would you take her to a public place, a public, a public atmosphere like that? Do you realize how many people could come to Walmart? Okay. Hell, your significant other was probably at Walmart shopping, buying diapers and stuff. And when she was going through uh, the baby aisle, she saw she saw you walking with this girl. Okay, so she just immediately this, okay, put it in reverse and see what was really going on with you and that girl, all right? So why would you take this girl out of all the places to take uh, this girl? Why would you take her to Walmart, okay? Why? It, it makes absolutely no sense, okay? It puzzles the, um, it, it puzzles the mind. Why would you do that, okay? My mind was exploded on that. You know, you mean tell me y'all couldn't go to a good library, okay? Take her to places where your girlfriend, your wife, your significant other is not expected to be at, okay? Like a like a library, okay? Maybe a day court, maybe day court. You know, I'm just thinking of all the places you can take a female at to entertain and sort of get some conversation going without spending a whole dollar, okay? Now, obviously you wanna take her to the Motel 8 or the Motel 6 or the Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. I get all that, okay? You know, you know, take to the zoo, okay? Why would you take your, this girl to Walmart, okay? Every time Dick and Harry goes to Walmart, okay? If, if you was if you didn't think you was gonna run in with, uh, you was gonna run in, I mean, run into your significant other at Walmart, you could have ran into, uh, you know, one of her friends, okay? You could have ran into her family members, okay? Why Walmart? There's another thing in the comment section people were saying, damn, the significant other looks better than uh, the side piece, okay? And I will have to say, I couldn't really see their faces. I saw the side piece face uh, momentarily, and I saw uh, his girl, I mean, I saw flashes, brief flashes of his girlfriend. And all I'm gonna say is, uh, guys, 
if 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 you're going to mess around, okay, at least mess around with somebody that's a little bit better than what you got at home, okay. What was the whole purpose of cheating on your girlfriend or your significant other, and your significant other, your girlfriend, your wifey looks better than the person that you're cheating uh, that 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 you're cheating with? I hate to do this okay but which by the way let's take a brief second okay on rating these girls from one to ten all right and okay in this corner the side piece the side piece has some type of scarf that she maybe found uh, off the street maybe at goodwill okay i don't know someone gave her that scarf six christmases ago i don't know uh, she had a little white scarf on. She was a little pudgy in some areas, okay? I didn't see any features that, you know, I could say with, with a shadow of a doubt, well, maybe the reason why he was cheating, he wanted to mess around with this girl because she had those those big old bitties, okay? Or maybe her face, okay? Maybe she had some, some junk in the trunk, okay? Well, you know, everything, it was all questionable. I didn't understand why he would... Uh, if you're gonna cheat on your significant other, why did you choose her? Who really runs the house? Because, it, you know, she made him take his shoes off. He basically walked out of Walmart barefooted, like for, uh, like the Flintstones, Barney Rubble, okay? Now, you know, maybe, you know, you could tell she she's the pants of the family, okay? She's she's the man of the house, okay? You can tell that she run things at the house, okay? And maybe that's one of the, the the things that he didn't like about her. Now, I will say from head to toe, she had a little ass on her. Uh, the body was okay. I can tell that, you know, that, you know, some guys, when they cheat on their significant other, you know, it's, it's like a payback thing, okay? Uh, it's not the fact that they horny or, you know, some girl found them interested. You know, you know, they, pro she, she, she's, you can tell that this is the type of woman that probably tells him each and every day that you ain't, it, that you ain't spit. You're never going to be spit. You're not about spit. You're nothing in life. You just a piece of spit. You're, you're a piece of spit. This, you're a piece of spit that she probably berates this guy, this guy every day 24 7 and this was his way of, of of showing her that you just think uh you just think it should be a blessing that i should have you when there's a multitude upon multitude of women which by the way in atlanta i believe it's 10 to 1 there's uh you know the ratio is 10 to 1 there's more women in atlanta than there are guys i don't know where these where this couple is from but you could get you got the tendencies of I got the I got the feeling my Negro senses were tingling that that's probably one of the reasons why he cheated on this girl. Okay, uh, she's very loud mouth. She can some. I feel like her attitude and her being rude now, by no stretch of the imagination, I'm saying it's a good idea to cheat on your significant other. If your significant other is treating you wrong and this that and girl they, they don't your significant other don't respect you then just leave walk away move on find someone else okay uh so that's what i gathered from this reaction video but guys tell me what you think rate comment subscribe it's your boy i'm up out of here Deuces.